Minecraft 1.20 is finally here, and with the addition of armor trims, camels, archaeology, and more, I decided to spend 100 days in Minecraft Hardcore 1.20 to explore all of the new features in this update. Alright, and here we go. It looks like we actually got a pretty good spawn. Let me just grab some of this wood. Wait, I think I already just found a shipwreck. Wait, no way. We can actually potentially get some armor trims from this. Please have armor trims. Please have armor trims. Oh, God, I'm going to die. Please have armor trims. Oh, that is... Uh... Oh, there's another chest. There's another chest. Uh... Are you serious right now? And I'm going to drown. Oh, my gosh. I have two hearts. Okay. <laughs> okay, maybe I should stay on land for now. Nom, 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 nom. But I actually have a whole bunch of stuff I want to do over these 100 days. And we have so much to explore in 1.20. I want to get armor trims, a sniffer, and even go on some archaeological digs. But if I don't get a better food source soon, I'm probably going to die. Ooh, but I'm very tempted to go down here in this cave. Where is all the iron at? I really don't want any of that copper. Okay, there's literally no iron in here at all. <clears throat> that's, that's pretty lame, isn't it? Yeah, that's pretty lame. I think I might have found myself some food. Oh my gosh, there's a baby drowned. What the? That is that is the weirdest thing ever. I've never seen one of those before. All right, dude, you can have those salmon. I I'm off. Oh, I see another shipwreck. Please give me something good. I'm kind of on the verge of death right now. Please, 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 please. Oh, yes, we got them. There's actually so much food in here as well. Yes, now I'm going to be able to make the best farm ever. Oh, I even got some armor. I do not want that one. And most importantly, I got these two coast armor trims. Uh, now I just need something to apply them to. And now I just need to make a smithing table. And I'm pretty sure if I add in a piece of armor, a trim, and an ore. Oh my gosh, it worked. This looks so sick. And I can change the color depending on what ore I use. Wait, I kind of want to try some copper. Oh yeah, that looks sick. Whoa. Yo, that is so cool. Yeah, I probably should have waited until I had some diamond armor. But I was just a little too excited. But I really want to keep exploring the new update to see what else we can find. Because so far, I have a really cool set of armor. But there's still 15 other trims to find. Sniffer eggs, new wood types, and so much more. Ugh, I barely just made that jump. Oh, I spy a village. And hello, Mr. Cow. Thank you for your leather. Hopefully you guys have some food here for me because I'm a pretty hungry guy. Do you guys have anything useful here? I'll take this. But it doesn't really look like this village has anything useful for me except for a bunch of barrels. Later on, we're going to have to find a desert village so that way I can get some camels because I heard that the camels are pretty crazy in this update. Well, that village was kind of useless, but at least I'm surrounded by spruce trees. There is something good that comes out of everything. What the heck kind of formation is that? That's pretty crazy looking. Oh, geez, that's a lot of creepers. Why are you chasing me? Yeah, I guess this area is a little dangerous. Can you please get out of here? Man, the view up here is actually super sick. But I think I want to set up a base really close to the beach. So that way I can find ruins and even some sniffer eggs. But first, let me grab a little bit of this spruce wood. So now I can bring spruce to wherever I end up living. Yeah, this is probably the best way to travel around your Minecraft world. I literally feel like I'm playing Mario car right now. Oh no, there's a forest fire. Guys, what happened over here? No, this is so bad. No, now I'm on fire. Oh, this is not good. I'm just gonna keep on running. Hey guys, I'm really sorry, but I'm very hungry and I need to eat something. I've finally reached the ocean. So let's see what else we can find. Oh, I'm gonna stay far away from that temple. Hopefully I can find some ocean ruins that'll contain a bunch of loot and maybe even some sniffer eggs. But I think I found a broken portal. So hopefully we can get a golden apple from this. Please give me something good. Okay, it's not an enchantment golden apple, but I'll take it. And I can swap out these for some gold boots. I am looking pretty good. Oh, why are there so many drowns in here? Wait, are you guys okay? Why are they moving so slow? Oh, there's even a baby drowned here. Oh, this guy even has a fishing rod. What up, my G? Can I, can I have that, please? Ooh. Ooh, some gold. And I'll always take some food. Wait a minute. I think I found suspicious gravel. Let me just see if I can craft a brush really quick. Oh, it worked. Now let's see what we can get. What? Are you serious right now? I get a wooden hoe? I just risked my life for a wooden hoe? Come on, please give me a sniffer egg. Oh my gosh, that's another wooden hoe, isn't it? Why? I think I'm getting a third wooden hoe. Oh, I think this is a pottery shard. Ow, I'm going to die. An explorer pottery shard. Oh, that is so cool. And if I just get two more of these, I'll be able to craft myself an awesome looking pot. Ooh, I think I found some more stuff to loot. Hello, are there any armor trims in here? Uh... There we go. So now I can upgrade my other pieces of armor. Yeah, I think I look super cool. And there's another ruin down here. And after some more exploring in the ocean, I was able to craft this. 
Whoa. Yeah, this thing is sick. It looks like it has little wardens all around it. Yeah, I can't wait to decorate my base with these. And speaking of bases, that's kind of something that I need. Oh, but there's another ruin over there. I just have to check for sniffer eggs. Oh, is that an emerald? Finally, something other than a wooden hoe. Yes, I finally found myself a cherry grove biome. Oh, these are so cool. I can even pick up the leaves that are all around the ground. It would probably be so cool to build with these. Yeah, this is definitely my new favorite wood type. So I think I'm probably going to build my house right next to the cherry grove. And I think right over here is probably the perfect spot to build. So let me just flatten it out. So I think for my house, I definitely want to use some oak logs and some cherry logs. And I think I'm just going to start out with a small house. So that way we can get back to exploring. Exploring. And now I have the perfect little cherry wood cottage. Yeah, there's not very much room in here. But at least I can fit all my stuff and even my brand new pot. And while I was building my house, I noticed that there was a pillager outpost right next to me. And I'm pretty sure that there's a chance to find armor trims at the pillager outposts. So let's go see what we can find. Oh, here we go. Hello, do you have any armor trims on you? Wait, there aren't even any LAs here. Please have armor trims. All right, chest, please have armor trims. Oh, we got them. Yes. Century armor trim. I am pretty excited to try these out. Thank you for this. I'm pretty sure it's only like a 10% chance of finding them. So that is super lucky. And I don't really have any armor that I can put these trips on. So I think it's about time I go get myself a set of diamond armor. Hopefully I can find a good cave around here. Ooh, what is this? Is this going to lead me to some diamonds? Yeah, I've got a good feeling about this cave. <laughs> Actually, it's a dead end. Okay, there are a lot of creepers down here. Go away. Wait, how the heck did a stone ore get down here? What the heck is this aren't we in deep slay layer oh yes finally one two three oh geez oh why are there two zombies coming at me where did you guys just all come from what the heck oh there's another diamond here come on there's got to be more around here somewhere diamonds where are you oh my gosh that literally just left me on two hearts there's literally creepers everywhere. Oh, another diamond. Oh, there's actually more than one over here. Oh, no. Yeah, this is not exactly what I wanted to see. Oh, actually, there's diamonds over here. Let me just grab this. I'm pretty sure that there's brand new loot that we can find in the ancient cities, but I also have to be careful to not run into any wardens. This is probably a really bad idea. I don't even have an elytra yet. Oh, I am so scared in here. Come on, there's gotta be good loot around here somewhere. Oh, that is a scary sight. I'm just gonna tiptoe right around this. Hopefully, I don't get caught by any wardens. This dude is literally about to spawn in a warden. I am getting away from here. Oh, it actually looks like I made it into a giant cave. Ooh, hello there. I think while I'm down here, I'm going to make myself a diamond pickaxe and get myself some obsidian because if I want to keep getting armor trims, I'm going to have to go find a bastion in the nether. All right, diamonds, where are you at? Oh, you're not a diamond. Ugh! Get away, get away, get away, get away. Go away. Ugh. Oh, hey, I got an ender pearl for that. All right, where are these diamonds at? There we go. Yes. Diamonds. Oh, there's only one. Oh, there's a zombie spawner. Can you guys just let me through? Oh, stop spawning. Oh, a name tag, a golden apple, and a bunch of other useless stuff. Diamondes. Diamonitas. Diamonatas. Diamonds. Yeah, I kind of ran out of things to say. More diamonds. Even more diamonds. Ah, home sweet home. Now I can make myself a bit of armor, and now I can upgrade some of my armor with these armor trims. Okay, that looks sick. Except I'm missing armor trims for my pants and boots. So I think it's about time I go out exploring and try to find some more armor trims and maybe even a camel. But first, I kind of need to get some more food. And I think I have some carrots and potatoes around here somewhere. So I should be able to make a pretty good sized farm. Okay, this is taking way too long. I need to find a better food source. I think I found something. What up, my G? All right, I think this is satiate my hunger for a bit, but now I should have enough food to go on a little bit of a journey because I really want to find a camel for my base. Uh, that is as soon as I can find a desert. I think I'm going to head over this way to the ocean and all I need to find to get myself a camel is a desert village. And then maybe we can even find a desert pyramid and get some great loot. My camel senses are tingling. There's definitely going to be a desert village somewhere around here. Come on, I just really want a camel. Oh, I see a tower. Yes, that is a village. Please tell me there's a camel 
camel in there somewhere. I just spent so long trying to find this place. Camel, camel, where are you, camel? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This guy is so sick looking. Oh, and I don't actually have a saddle, do I? There's gotta be one in here somewhere. Oh, come on. Okay, it looks like I'm gonna have to go find myself a saddle somewhere. Mr. Camel, I will be back for you. Maybe there's a desert pyramid somewhere around here because that might actually have a saddle in it. All right, if I was a saddle, where would I be? Wait, there actually could be one in here. Wait, why is this a dead end? Okay, that is not what I wanted to see. Get out of here. Ow, I got poisoned. I need to break this spawner. Now, where are all the chests at? No, 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 no. Oh, yeah. Yes. All right, Mr. Camel, are you ready for this? Oh, this guy's actually fast. Now I just got to figure out how to get you back to my base because I kind of got here from the ocean. Uh, we're gonna have to take the long way home. Dang, this place is cool looking though. Ooh, what do we have here? It looks like this is a mine shaft. Is there any gold in here? Okay, this is actually looking pretty empty. Hello? All right, Mr. Camel, we have a lot of blocks to travel through. No way. Is that a desert temple? I have been waiting for this moment. I'm pretty sure that there's actually an armor trim that we could get from a desert desert temple. Please tell me it's in here. Thank you for the TNT. This will be useful later. And what do we get? Oh, a diamond. More diamonds? A looting two book. Wait, we actually got seven diamonds from that. Okay, the loot was kind of garbage, except for the diamonds. But I was really hoping we'd get more armor trims. All right, let's keep it moving, Mr. Camel. Actually, I probably need a name for this guy. Yeah, I think I'm going to name him Ron. All right, Ron, we've got a long way to go, brother. That is after I take a quick nap. Wait, are there going to be more camel? over here oh there he is oh i think they like each other wait can you breed camels oh my gosh it's working oh oh my gosh this is the cutest thing i've ever seen oh he's so cute all right ronnie jr what's up my dude dang it, i really wish i had more saddles so that i could take him with me i swear i'm coming back for you ronnie jr but now we should actually probably try to make it home ah home sweet home all right ron i think it's about time i make you a good home and i even grabbed a bunch of sand so that way i can make him feel more at home i I think it would be really cool if I built Ron a cool little sand castle. All right, let's see if I can pull this off. Let me just build some towers. Now I just got to build up the walls. Okay, the only thing this sand castle needs now is a flag. And I think I have some wool somewhere around here. Aha. Yep, that looks sick. Okay, but where did my camel just go? Ah, uh, there he is. All right, Ron, I just built you the coolest house ever. Dude, this is literally like double the size of my cottage. Now my camel is pretty much the coolest house ever. Oh, I think he likes it. Wait, how did you just get out of there? Ron, you're supposed to stay in your house. I might need to make this a little taller. There we go. Okay, now that I have the coolest camel in the world, and I built him an awesome house, I really want to do some exploring and find some trail ruins. So I'm going to be needing this, and I'm also going to take my bed with me, because it might take me a little while to to find one of these. They can only spawn in certain biomes. And they're pretty much hidden underground. Oh, I found a tiger. This is a really good sign. I'm pretty sure if we just kind of run along the edges of this biome, we should find some gravel. And that would mean that there's an ancient ruin underneath. What is there a clay block doing here? Oh, I think I found one. Oh, I just got a candle from that. Yeah, I finally found some suspicious gravel. And hopefully I can get some pottery shards and even some rare armor trims from here. I'm pretty sure we just kind of have to keep digging down because most of the structure is underground and it can get to be really huge. There's so much terracotta down here and it looks like I found some more suspicious gravel and it's giving me a pottery shard the friend pottery shard All right, then. Oh, that's an armor trim. Yes, the host armor trim I am so applying this when I get home. Let's see if we can find any others. Come on. Come on Oh, it's just a dead bush. Is this a glass pane? All right, that's kind of random There's actually so much random stuff going on in here. Okay I think I've explored this entire trail ruin at least I hope I didn't miss anything and I got a ton of stuff But the really only only things I care about are these pottery shards and some of these host armor trims. Now, let me just apply this to my armor. Yeah, that is looking pretty awesome. And I think the only way that this could get better is if I enchanted all of my armor and tools. But I really need a bunch of leather if I want to be able to make a level 30 enchant setup. And I only have a few right now. So I think I should probably try to go find myself some cows. Hello, is there anybody up here? I'm pretty sure I might have killed all the animals around my base. Oh, hey, but you guys could give me leather, right? Yes, I found a cow. Oh, there's actually a lot of you around here. Well, since I only need two of you, 
Oh, and there's actually some sugar cane down here, which I really need to make paper. But you guys have to come back to my base. What is going on down here? Go away, sheep. Oh, wait a second. Guys, I kind of need you to just wait here for a second. I have to go do something. I, I promise I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, that's so bad. Yeah, this is a, not a good chest. And we finally made it. Okay, now you guys just have to hang out in there until I make you guys a home. And let me make sure that I also plant down some of the sugar cane. And I even got some crops to harvest. I cannot wait to eat all of this stuff. And I guess I should also probably just expand my farm a little bit. So that way I can get more wheat to breed my cows. And I guess I can also plant down some pumpkins and melons. And while I wait for all my wheat to grow, I think I should probably go and harvest some materials so that way I can build my cows a home. And I know I'm heading straight for this cherry wood because this is basically the only thing I want to build with right now. So let me grab a bunch of cherry wood. And some stone that I can smelt into stone bricks. All right, cows, are you guys ready for the best home ever? Why don't you guys even look excited? And while they do that, I'm probably going to build them a barn somewhere over here. And you guys already know that I have to use the cherry wood. It just looks so good. Ah, uh, that sunset is beautiful. And actually, I don't think I really like how the stone bricks look. So I'm probably not going to be using them. So getting all that was kind of a waste of time. Instead, I think I want to use some oak wood. And I want to do something sort of how I did on my house. I think something like that would look pretty good. So now I just have to fill. Can I build, please? And now I can just fill this in with a bunch of cherry slabs. Okay, cows, I think I'm ready to move you guys in. Wait, did I just seriously forget to add in walls? Hold on, cows. You guys are going to have to wait a second. All right, now I think this thing is finally done. Except I need to put a slab there. Ugh. Yeah, that looks amazing. Guys, you're all going the wrong way. Come come on. We're almost there. And there we go. This is actually way bigger than my house. So maybe I should work on expanding my base. Because this cottage is barely able to hold all of my stuff. But before I do that, I think it's time we head into the nether. So that way I can start to get some XP. So that when my cows are ready, I can do a bunch of enchanting. Why does my nether portal look like that? Let me just make sure I have plenty of food for this and some blocks. And hopefully I don't find anything too dangerous in the nether. Oh my gosh, I'm in a lava pool. Ouch. This is the worst spawn ever. What is this spawn? Oh my gosh. I'm never going to be able to find anything in here. I think I already just found a fortress over there. Oh, there's a lot of mobs up here. Oh my gosh. This is so dangerous. I'm literally over a giant lava ocean. Wait, there might be chests down here. Come on, give me some loot. Oh, a chest. That is garbage. There's got to be more around here. More garbage. Are there any good chests around here or are they all garbage? Oh, this is not looking good for me. There's so many wither skeletons here. Where'd you guys even just come from? I swear I was just alone. Ugh. And I just got hit by a blaze. Oh, I'm losing health really fast. Go away. Oh, that was really close. I can't believe how many mobs there are in this fortress. This place is literally a death trap. So I think I should find somewhere a little safer to hang out. Like right about here. Ah, oh, this is what I needed. Give me that sweet XP. Oh, uh, that's not good. I'm definitely going to need to make a new one of those. But where are my diamonds? Ah, good as new. And now I just need to get a little bit of leather. Okay, everybody, that, that's your mom now. Don't cancel me. And I'm going to need some of this. Kazam. And now I can finally get to enchanting some of my tools and armor. Oh, wait a second. I forgot lapis. Please tell me there's lapis somewhere around here. Please, please, please. Oh my gosh, I don't have it. Oh, actually, <laughs> I found it. Okay, what enchants can... Are you serious right now? Unbreaking? Yeah, that is coming right off my sword. That should do for now. And now I've got some pretty good enchants on my tools and armor. Except I should probably craft a diamond shovel and axe. There we go. I won't be needing you guys anymore. I'm pretty much resorting to putting storage up here on my ceiling. Okay, nobody just heard that voice crack. But I feel like now since I have a pretty good base set up, I have a barn for my cows and even an epic sandcastle for my pet camel. Wait, where the heck is he? Oh no. Oh no, are you still in here, dude? Thank goodness, Ron. I thought you escaped. But now that I have so much stuff set up at my base, I think it's about time I try to find myself a sniffer because I really want to make a house for the sniffers and even get their special flowers. Wait, what the heck is going on over here? How did you guys all just escape? Oh, this is not going to fly. You guys have to go right back into this barn immediately. How did you guys even get out of here? But the only thing is I don't really know where to find a sniffer. Yeah, where the heck do these things even spawn? So it looks like I have to go to the ocean to find a sniffer. Wait, that doesn't even make any sense. Ron, we are going to have to go really far to find one of these guys. So let me get myself a boat. 
All right, buddy, you stay here. Oh my gosh, my boat is so cool. What the heck? This is the coolest thing ever. So I'm pretty sure that the sniffer eggs spawn in suspicious gravel inside of warm ocean ruins. So I'm going to have to find one of those first. Whoa, look at this world generation. Is that a mine shaft in there? Wait, there could be something good up here. Come on, where's the loot at? All right, come on. There's got to be a chest in here somewhere. Give me some golden apples. No, 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 no. Come on, go away. What the heck kind of loot is this? Oh my gosh, that is so bad. And that's my cue to get back to finding a sniffer. Wait a minute. Am I actually inside a warm ocean? Oh, I am. That would mean that there's actually going to be ruins with sniffer eggs somewhere around here. All right. If I was a sniffer, where would I be? Oh, man. This is going to be harder than I thought. Does this guy have a fishing rod? What the? But I think this is actually a ruin. So one of these suspicious sands might have a sniffer's egg in it. Ah, uh, no, but it's just an emerald. What about this one? Wait, another emerald? Are you serious? I pretty much just have to go through through all the suspicious sand until I find a sniffer egg. Yeah, it said I'm just gonna take a nap. Wait, I think that's the only ruin around here. That is not a good sign. Isn't there supposed to be like clusters of these around here? Oh, it's gonna take me forever to find a sniffer egg. And hopefully I don't drown. <laughs> Oh my gosh. So after searching a couple of different warm ocean ruins. Oh, it's a sniffer egg. Yes, we got one. Yes, we finally got our sniffer egg. I want to hatch this thing so bad, but I want to find a second one so that way I can breed them and have a whole sniffer population back at my base. Nice. Now, where did I put Ron? Ron, there you are, buddy. Ron, you won't believe what I found on my journey. Look at these. I know, man. I know. All right, let's go. We have such a long journey. I'm really curious to see what happens when I place one of these down. Let me just make them a little nursery really quick. And I think if we just place the sniffer eggs down like this. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. Hopefully they'll hatch really soon. You guys just spend some time hatching. And while you do that, I'm going to head into the nether because there's actually a lot of stuff I need from there. Let me just make a decent bow and grab some arrows. And I still don't know why my nether portal looks like that, but here we go. So the main thing I need to find in the nether is a bastion because there's a lot of really important stuff that I need to get from there. Like some smithing templates that actually will allow me to craft some netherite armor. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's a good sign. I think I might've found a bastion. Give me these gold blocks. Oh, hey guys. Well, that was dumb. I pretty much just wasted all my arrows, but at least now I should be safe to come in here and get some loot. These are pretty nice looking. Where are these chests? Oh, geez. There's more of these guys down here. Oh, I think I found more brutes. Go away. Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh my God. I'm on one heart. Okay. I need to be a little bit more careful. I think I'm just going to block these staircases off for now. And let's see what we can get from these chests. Oh, some golden carrots. I will be eating those, but there's still a lot more we have to loot. And I'm pretty sure that the smithing templates and the armor trims are probably in the treasure room all the way at the bottom. So we have a long way to go. Oh no, there's another the brute in here. Okay. This is getting to be a little too dangerous. Oh, some golden apples. I'll take these arrows and I could always use more obsidian. There are so many brutes over there. Bam. Get out of here. Oh, this place is massive. This is probably one of the biggest bastions I've ever seen. Go away. Gosh, there's so many brutes up here. Oh, hello there. I promise I'm not taking any of your stuff. Oh, another chest. Oh, more golden carrots. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's get to this treasure. What do we got in these chests? <gasps> oh, oh, we got some really good stuff in here. Diamond sword. And there's so many gold blocks here. Don't mind if I do. I can't believe what I just got from this bastion already. And after looting this bastion, I headed over to the next one to get even more loot. Oh, here we go again. All right, where is your guys' loot? Oh, here it is. Another smithing template. And some more golden apples and bone blocks. Ooh, let's see what else we can find in here. I'm so scared of all these brutes. Oh my goodness. How did you guys get in here? I thought I blocked this off. Okay, 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 okay. Haha, -ha, you guys can't get me, can you? Well, that was easy. Now let's see what I can find in these chests. <gasps> Another smithing template. Even more obsidian and some gold. And there's even more chests up here. Ouch, what the heck? That hurts, that hurts. I'm gonna try to get this loot and get out of here as quickly as possible. <gasps> no way we found it. Yes. I finally got the snout armor trim. That was actually really hard to find. I think I saw another chest up here somewhere. A bunch of spectral arrows. Okay. Wait, where did this guy come from? And he just disappeared. But I'm pretty sure that I got all of the loot from this bastion. Ooh, an ancient debris. So I should probably start heading back to my portal. Ah, there she is. And I actually got so much treasure from this bastion. Yeah, this is kind of insane. And I think with all this gold, I want to make myself some golden carrots because my food source right now is pretty much just bread. So let me just craft some of these. 
Yeah, I'm pretty stacked now. And I even have a bunch of golden apples. And most importantly, a brand new armor trim. Oh, my new chest plate is so cool looking now. I've had so many different armor trims today. Oh, no way. The sniffers have finally hatched. I'm not really sure what to do with them now. Oh, they're so cool looking. I need to think of some names for you guys. And we should probably get started on building them an epic home. Just like I did for my cows and my camel. So I think it's material gathering time. And now using a bunch of cherry wood, I'm going to map out a big outline for where the sniffers are going to live. All right, Sniffers, welcome to your brand new home. Oh, I think they like it. But to make it even better for them, I want to add in some details, like a couple cherry leaf bushes and even a few cherry trees. And I'm just going to add in some grass. And now the Sniffers paradise is fully complete. Yeah, this place is awesome. So now I have the Sniffer sanctuary right next to my camel sand castle. These guys are actually living way better than me. I'm going to have to make some upgrades later on. But for now, I think I should try to get some things ready to fight the Ender Dragon, like making sure I have enough arrows and even the best enchants for my tools and armor and then i headed into the nether to get some blaze rods and plenty of ender pearls now i can craft some eyes of ender and let's go fight this dragon that is as soon as i get some stuff that i need all right ron and sniffers i'll be back which way is this taking me oh that already broke are you serious i guess we're not off to a very good start another one just broke what the heck i'm kind of curious to see if this one will break oh thank gosh oh i think we're getting closer i think that means that we have to start digging down Oh, I think we made it to the library. Are there any chests in here? I'm pretty sure that we can find an armor trim in here if we can find a chest. Oh, there it is. And there's another one down here. Oh, another armor trim. Oh, this is actually a really good book. I don't even have any protection for stuff yet. So I'm definitely going to be applying that. And I guess I'll take some of these bookshelves with me. But more importantly, I should probably try to find the portal. Oh, we're in a lush cave. Are there any axolotls in here that would like to come with me? No? Uh, okay. Ah, the portal room. Stupid silverfish. Let's do this thing. Hopefully, I have enough arrows for this fight. I promised my sniffers I would bring them back a dragon egg. Let's see if I can get some of these towers down from up here. Bam. Oh, I should probably get down from here before I get hit with dragon's breath. I never, ever miss those clutches. Oh, there's more dragon breath. No, no, no. Let me get these. Oh, come on. Can I land a shot? Almost there. And I think we just have three more. So close. Got it. And I think this is the last tower. So if I can land a bow shot, that, that would be nice. Ah! Oh, I did not land that. All right, dragon, get your butt down here. Oh, there's so much dragon's breath down here. Let me get some shots on him. Ugh. I'm ready to get launched by this thing. Oh my gosh, wait a minute. Um, I almost just went right into the void. That is actually terrifying. Dragon, please don't do that again. Oh, he's landing again. Let me get some hits on him. Come on, we're almost there. Oh, we keep getting so close to the edge. I, I don't like that. Hopefully these are the last few hits we have to do. Come on, we're almost there. And we got him. Goodbye, dragon. Ooh, XP. Let me grab my dragon egg. I finally got myself a dragon egg. But there's one more thing I want to do here in the end. And that is go visit the end cities. That's behind me, isn't it? There's a super rare armor trim that we can find in the end cities. And I really want to get one for my collection. Oh, wait a minute. Are you serious right now? There is absolutely no way that this is my spawn. I have never, ever seen something like this before. And there's an end ship over there. That's actually kind of insane. I don't like these shulkers. I really just want the treasure that's in here. And I'm levitating. And I think there's actually another end city out there. So after we loot this one, we have a whole other one to go to. Let's see if I can make this bucket clutch. Oh, this is really risky. Oh, okay. Probably should not be doing those. I always forget that this is hardcore. Oh, a chest. That is not good loot. Let me just go up here and see if I can find something better. I just got to get through the shulker gauntlet. Oh, here they are. Oh, there we go. We also got some diamond armor and some gold. And this chest is not good. This armor is insane. I'm going to swap it out for now. Please don't fall off because I will probably be going straight into the void if I do. Yeah, right about now would be a really bad time for an enderman to land up here. Oh, we're almost there. Thank you. You? Yes. Oh, I almost forgot to get the dragon head. There we go. And now I should be able to fly. Except I kind of forgot fireworks. So I can only really glide down for now. But now I can go check out this neighboring end city to see what else I can get. Hopefully there's more diamond armor in here. What do we got up here? Ooh, a mending pickaxe. A bunch of gold and iron. And some diamonds. Thank you for that. Oh gosh, I'm really low on health. I think that's probably my cue to leave. That is as soon as I loot this end ship. 
Now I can get a second elytra. Ooh, some Prof 4 diamond leggings. I actually have really good armor now, except for my boots. They're, they're still kind of bad. Oh, it feels good to be home. But with all the loot I brought back, I'm really starting to run low on storage space in my house. So I think I definitely need to make a pretty big upgrade to my small little cottage. Oh, come on, go away, guys. No one wants you here. Oh my goodness. I said leave. But of course, for my house upgrade, I'm definitely going to build it with cherry wood. I mean, what other wood would I use? Exactly. None of them. And I don't really want the outline to be like a normal shape, so... Yeah, this shape is looking pretty crazy, so let's fill it in with some walls. And I want this house to have plenty of windows. Okay, now how on earth am I gonna put a roof on this thing? Hey, Ron, do you have any ideas for me? I think I'm just gonna have to use a bunch of slabs since the house isn't really a proper square shape. And the house is actually fully done. Wait, what the? Um, wait, did my sniffer get loose? Oh my gosh, he broke out of his cage. Wait, we got some intruders here. Just leave. Yeah, looks like my sniffer enclosure is snifferless. And instead he made his way into my new cherry house. But at least he's giving me these flower pods. I'm pretty sure that I can just plant these around. Hopefully these give me some really cool flowers. How did you even get in my house? All right then. Oh, he's actually digging up some seeds for me. All right, sniffer, while you do that, I should probably start decorating the interior of my house house starting with putting some flooring in but now i just need to decorate the interior and i have a ton of room and i think i'm going to start out by adding in a storage unit right over here and i'm also going to add in some furnaces and a crafting station and some other little details okay i think my house is finally complete this is looking amazing and literally everything that's in here is pink i think the sniffer likes it too because this guy's just kind of hanging out around here oh, i almost forgot to add in some lanterns so that way this entire house is pretty lit up but now i just have to go get all of my items and move them into the new house which is probably going to take me like five years there is so much stuff in here i'm just realizing now that there's actually another new wood type that i haven't found yet oh come on how did i just do that let me just fix that but there's an entire new wood type that I haven't found yet. Hey, Ron, are you up for an adventure? Actually, I think I might want to take my elytra for this trip. Because then I can actually get to where I need to go a lot quicker. Oh, except I don't have any rockets. Th that might be a problem. I think it might be about time I go creeper hunting. There's always creepers around me. Why is it that whenever I actually need them, they're nowhere to be found? Creepers, where the heck are you? Yeah, there's literally nothing down here. Oh, here we go. No, no, please don't blow up. I'm never ever gonna get gunpowder, am I? A mob spawner? Oh, come on. Why can't there ever be creeper spawners? I don't need any spiders right now. Ooh, I'll take that. And this. And actually, there's a ton of gunpowder in here. Thank you. Now I just have to find more creepers. Oh my gosh. Did that really just happen? Oh, hello, creeper. No, please don't blow up. Ah. Oh. Aha, here we go. Creepers. Oh, I see some diamonds. Oh, but there's so many mobs here. Oh, I actually got a music disc for that. Thank you, Mr. Skeleton. Dang it. But let me grab these diamonds really quick. Oh, it's literally just one. Dang it, man. Are there any more creepers over here? Or diamonds? Oh, yes. It's still just a single vein. Ah. <sighs> Now I just need some of this, and now I can craft some rockets. I can finally fly. Oh, this is so nice. Oh, it's so cool up here. But in order to find this next type of wood, I'm going to have to fly around until I can find a jungle. And just to make sure I don't run out of storage, I'm going to craft myself a shulker box. There we go. Now let's go find this jungle. Wait, what is that? This looks like there could potentially be some good loot over here. Let me put on my chest plate, because there's a lot of drowns in here. What up, dude? Okay, having knocked back on my sword is kind of annoying. I just want to check your chests. Oh, there's so many of them. Guys, please just back off. What? Where do you guys keep coming from? I think this is the last one. Okay, actually, I lied. There's another one right here. But I'm pretty sure now we can come down here and get whatever's in this chest. Are you serious? Wait, I think there's actually a trail ruin down here. But I don't have my brush on me, so I can't really do much. So instead, I'm just going to loot these chests to see what we can get. Ooh, a fishing rod. A map. Another fishing rod. Ooh, another map. And what could be as a broken portal? Oh, uh, that is not very good. This is a lot of really random loot. So I think I'm just going to keep searching for the jungle biome. Ooh, a pillager post. Please give me more armor trims. That is not armor trims. Oh, jeez. Whoa, there's so many of you guys here. Oh, I don't even have my 
chest plate on. Ah, what the heck? I've never seen as many pillagers in one spot. I thought only one raid captain could spawn in at a time. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so low. Guys, please don't kill me. There's still more of them. Okay, I need to eat. Oh, this is really, this is really bad. How did they get me so low? Okay, I think that's all of them. Oh my gosh, look how many arrows are in me. What the heck? Oh, but there are a lays in here. What up, little guys? Oh, they're so cute looking. Wait, wait, where are you going? No, no, no. Well, I guess that didn't last long. I should really get back to finding a jungle. That straight up almost killed me. Oh, we found a jungle. Oh, wait, this is actually a swamp. Whoops. Why does this look so much like a jungle? Oh, actually, there's a jungle right there. So I guess it still works out. There's so much mud down here. Yeah, I'm probably gonna drown if I try to harvest too much of this. Now I just need to find a bunch of bamboo. Okay. This might be enough. I'm gonna need a ton of this stuff. And then with this, I'm pretty sure we should be able to... Oh, that actually didn't work. Maybe we need a crafting table first. There we go. Oh, these are so cool looking. And I'm pretty sure with these, I can craft bamboo planks, which look even cooler. Oh, this is so neat looking. I'm gonna put my entire inventory into this shulker box and go get a bunch of bamboo. I think we can build something really cool with all of this. That is one full inventory. Let me just craft these into some blocks and I'm probably gonna need more than this. Did I just break my sword? Oh no, that's not good. But at least now I have a ton of bamboo. And I think I kind of want to build a bamboo house out here. So let me just clear a little area on top of this hill. All right, let's see what I can throw together using some bamboo logs. First, I want to make sure I have a little porch on this house. And then I can build the actual house itself right here. And I'm gonna use these blocks for the flooring. Now let me just build the rest of the frame for this house. Oh, I can even craft stairs out of these. And let's see if we can make a door. Oh my gosh, we can. This is so cool looking. And let me just finish up the rest of the walls. Now let me just make some slabs for the roof. And I also want to use some bamboo fence. This is probably the coolest bamboo block. I really like how these fences look. And for the roof, it's going to be mainly a bunch of slabs. Yeah, that looks pretty good. I actually really like how the bamboo house is starting to look. Yeah, I think this might be one of the coolest things I've built in this world so far. Let me just get some glass to throw in for the windows. And now I just got to fill in these windows and the house is complete. Yeah, this is like pretty much the perfect jungle house. I really don't know which one I like better, cherry or bamboo, because they're both really cool looking. I can't wait to build with more bamboo in my main hardcore world. But since I'm already in a jungle, I kind of want to see if I can find a jungle temple because there's a pretty rare armor trim that we can find in there. And this jungle seems to be pretty massive. Hello, are there any jungle temples out here anywhere? Oh my gosh, this place is massive. Oh my gosh, there's one right here. This thing is so hidden. It's basically on the bottom of a cliff. All right, let, let's see what we can get from in here. Oh, it's so dark down here. Let's see if I remember the code. Oh my gosh. Oh, all right then. I'm pretty sure I just lost my pickaxe. Okay, we're not off to a very good start. And the chest here doesn't seem to be super great. Ouch. Let me just craft a pickaxe and let's see if we can find something in the secret chest. Oh, it's just a zombie. Okay, it's just a zombie in full gold armor. My man, what the heck? Ooh, sticky pistons. Thank you. And let's see what we can get. Ooh, some diamonds and even an emerald. I will take it. Oh, I really want to fly through this. That was epic, but I think it's about time I head back to my base. And we're back. Let me just drop off all my stuff. But I think I really need to make myself a new sword and a pickaxe. Wait, actually, I already have a diamond pickaxe. And I'm pretty sure I can put this book on it to make it an efficiency three. And for my sword, I'm going to craft an entirely new one. Yeah, that's not going to cut it. But I'm going to enchant a whole new sword because I kind of need a new one. Oh, that's pretty good. Ooh, sharpness four. I'm actually pretty happy with that. And I'm also going to upgrade my boots by adding this protection four book onto them. And I should probably try to repair them as well. There we go. And I almost forgot I don't have any enchants on my shovel. That should do. And I guess while I'm here, I can also re-enchant my diamond axe. Oh, wait. Now I want to see if I can get a fortune three pickaxe. Please give me one. That's actually better than the pickaxe I already have. So I guess I'll take it. And I actually almost forgot that I haven't built a shrine for the dragon egg yet. And I really want to do that. So let me just grab some cherry wood. And I made a little outline to make sure that everything stays symmetrical. But I just want to build a little bit of a room to put the dragon egg in. Let me just add in some pillars. Now let me just add in some walls. and some flooring. And I'm gonna make these outer posts into some pillars by using stairs. And right here is where I'm gonna put the dragon egg. And now I just have to add a roof onto this thing. 
There we go. This is so cool looking. I should probably add in some light. And there we go. The dragon egg shrine is complete. Cherry wood literally makes everything look amazing. Wait, these flowers that the sniffer gave me are actually super cool. We got a torch flower and a pitcher plant. And the torch flowers give me orange dye. And the pitcher plants give me cyan dye. But I think instead I'm probably just going to plant these around my base. Because they're so cool looking. And if I can find my sniffer anywhere around here, I could actually get more seeds. But unfortunately, they both left their habitat. I still can't believe they escaped. Also, guys, if you do want to download this world, make sure to become a channel member and you'll have access to the seed and the world file. And you'll have access to the seed and the world download file. So that way you can play alongside my 1.20 100 days world. But since we're closing in on day 100, I really want to try using these netherite smithing templates. But I kind of need some netherite to do so. And since I already have one ancient debris, I'm already halfway there. Well, well, not really, but it still counts. So let's go see if we can find some netherite to make some upgrades to our gear. At first, I need to get out of this horrible biome. And this looks like the perfect spot. Okay, except there's a lava pool right there. I might want to try and avoid that. Oh, hey, we just got an achievement. Well, that was easy. Oh, Bastion. Yeah, I don't know if I can keep myself from going in here. And there's actually armor trims that we can get from the Bastion. So I'm pretty curious to see if we can find them. Maybe I should loot this thing. Oh, there's brutes over here. I'm just going to try and sneak over here to the chests and hopefully they don't see me. Oh, no. I've been caught. I've been caught. I need to get away from here. Abort mission. I don't even have a chest plate. Oh gosh, that is really dangerous in there. And since I don't have my chest plate, I'm at a high risk to die. And there's a lot of brutes in there. So I have to do this really strategically. I think I'm going to try and trap these guys somehow. That is if these hoglins will go away. Oh lord. Okay, I think I might have this guy trapped in here. So I can just give him a couple hits. That was easy. Wait, I think that was all of them. Oh, I lied. There's no armor trims in here, but I'll still take some loot. Oh, and I already found more chests. Hey, Mr. Piglin. Don't mind me. I'm just trying to make my way through here. Wow, there are a lot of you. Oh, we actually got pig step and still no armor trims. I still have to check all the way down here. Hello, piglins. Oh my goodness. You guys can't get me from up here, can you? Oh, I forgot I actually have knockback on my sword. All right, I really want to get down to those chests all the way at the bottom over here. I was actually expecting there to be a lot more brutes down here, but there's really just magma cubes. Go away. Oh no. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so low. No. <sighs> Well, I guess there goes my hardcore world. Honestly, this world was a lot of fun, but I guess it was kind of stupid to go into a bastion with an elytra on. This world was so much fun and we did so much. So make sure that you like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to join as a channel member to have access to the world download and seed. And I'll see you guys later.